Hi guys, welcome to another video on the JB hey. and Millie channel. So guys, today we are returning to the island of Cupicide. So this is an island that's a little bit familiar to us, we've toured before. However, we have been told that this beautiful homely seaside town has been renovated for Christmas. And I feel like this is, you know, kind of hitting home with me because Obviously with the lockdown here, I've not been able to go home for a while and, you know, so for me, maybe, you know, in a few days time, I'm going to be returning to that homely kind of seaside winter wonderland. So yeah, it's kind of hitting right now and I'm just really excited to share this with you guys. So remember, if you subscribe to the channel and turn on notifications, we are bringing you these gorgeous Christmas islands daily for the rest of the month up until Christmas. Yeah, it's going to be amazing and... Oh, the ones we've done so far are fabulous, so the playlist that will be available, so please make sure to go give all those videos some love. But this tour, I am so anticipating this, because the memories of Cooperside from last time, it's just such a grand place. It's like an island is a mixture of a palace, and of course that seaside aesthetic, with some of the kind of um, lighthouses. So, just the thought of it in Christmas is just mind-blowing. Oh, and here oh, we and go. the snow's falling. <gasps> Whoa. Oh, look at resident services with the snow. The little islanders wearing the little winter hats. Oh my gosh. Wow. Oh, they weren't kidding. They've really done this. Oh my gosh. So the creator's information should be on screen right now. Please make sure to give them some support because they are absolutely incredible. Like we say, this is the second tour of this island and we just cannot wait. Oh my gosh. Oh. Well worth checking out. We are so excited for this. Ew. Oh, look, there they are. Hi. Oh, blessing, sweet child. Oh, I think this is like the same thing they said to us last time. So like, again, just like the kind of the linguist at use there. It just makes this place seem so regal. What oh, presents? It's exciting. Oh my gosh. And again, presents from the sleigh underneath the tree. This is just... Underneath? Sorry. Mind blowing. We didn't even get in the first two minutes and I was singing on this one. I'm sorry, guys. Okay, so we have oh. some rim glasses. Ooh, you look like Harry Potter. Look, it's very professorial. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, we're getting decked out. Oh, wow. That was one of your favourite variants as it well, was. JV. It's the one that I said that's the one that I wanted, and they're giving it to me. Comedian's pants. Okay, <laughs> so they know me Feeling far too like well. Home, JB. Oh yeah. Oh, oh my gosh. Wow. High tops. Oh, I'm quivering in my high tops. <laughs> there we go. I'm in love with you. You are looking so super much. cute, JV. Oh my gosh, I'm spelling things all higgledy piggledy today. Look at this. This is so cool. Tour begins, ooh. So as JB said, uh, kind of on the flyover, it looks quite a regal place and you can still see that with the Celeste items on the top, but then you have this gorgeous kind of Christmas twist. It's really prominent. Like, look at these designs, it's just stunning. Wow. <laughs> No, oh, beach party. Yay. Party. Awful that. Oh, poor JB. <laughs> Look, and it just looks so great in the snow. It does. I'm loving how the entire island aesthetic changes. Like the sea looks darker, the um, beach looks lighter. And look, like we were saying, it's just so grand. Like the whole entire place. It just seems like a palace, like trading post. This is incredible. It's just such a vibe. It's an amazing vibe. Oh, and they've used that new um, kind of pillar, half pillar from Turkey Day. Oh, gosh. 
gosh, yes. Look here, guys. That's so cool. And that fits in with the aesthetic so well that it's almost like that could have been there the entire time. Oh, and look here. We have a pile of gifts. Really nicely fa like fitting in with this theme there. Oh, and the band. I wonder what Christmas song they're going to be singing. No doubt we'll find out in the Q&A section at the end. But... Oh, I love the... Sorry. Right. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I can't not sing. It's Christmas. Christmas. Oh, no. Whoa. Ooh, another Christmas bandstand. You get you can be Mariah Carey, JB. I am. I am Mariah Carey. Look at this. Concert hall. Oh, look at that! Like, by the snow, they've done, like, um, snowflake custom designs. Oh, wow. Oh, Abel Sisters? Oh my gosh, look at that! There's two people um, in an intense game of chess. Oh, and they that's called The Thinker, isn't it? Yeah. Check me. They're just there, contemplating the next move. Queen's Gambit. Oh, kimono. Oh, the lovely little bamboo area here, JV. Bamboo is my vibe. And again. Look at the bamboo in the yeah. snow. Yeah. The tailor. Oh, of course, because it's by the Able Sisters. That makes so much sense. Mmm. A little laundrette. Just look at all the custom design they've put down. This must have taken so long. Oh, the shoe shop. I love that. And again, the seaside vibe is perfectly encapsulated with these stands. Like, it looks great. Oh, look at them. They just look so chill. Buy your Jordans here. <laughs> We're going to be on fleek. Oh, the Yule Log. Oh, and these like little ice cream pops. Oh, there's more ice pops here too, look, and a Christmas tree. Oh, this is ridiculously See, festive. JB, JB's probably gonna be premiering this tour right now, and you're prob and like half of our viewers are gonna be like, did they just say ice pop? Like that's such a common like everybody has a different word for it. Yeah, I mean, I, I mean, I'm kind of just saying ice pop because it sounds good. I think ordinary, I'd say ice lolly, yeah, an I ice lolly, or just too. a lolly. I don't know what they call it over in the states, like a, a freezy pop, yeah, a popsicle. Annalise, if you're watching, please tell us. Yeah. Fish <laughs> market. We can rely on you. But yeah, I absolutely am premiering this. So to everyone in our kind of premiere chat, thank you so much for showing up. You guys are all amazing. And hi, future JB. Oh, look at that. Ooh. <gasps> oh my gosh, I feel like I've not seen this variant of the Spring You Ride on no, before. No, but it fits so well with the, with the pumpkin. And a real Cinderella theme because you have the shoes on the pedestal at the yeah, end Yeah, Cinderella. There. And you this it. isn't something that they've just done for Halloween, I'd like to point out, because they are stood on a turkey day item. So this has been a developing thing. Yes. The Millie sorry first. Yes. Yay. You nailed that. <laughs> wow. Oh my god. Oh, and there's a clock because you have to be back by midnight. I'm tempted to try and type bippelty boppelty boo, but I, I can't. Bippelty boppity boo. Oh, the birthday section. Oh, this is making me emotional. Happy wow. birthday to you. Oh my gosh. Oh. We need cake. I want cake. <gasps> Look at this. Oh, wow. So again, this gorgeous season. And look, they've put so much work into this already. There's the, um, oh my goodness, I'm falling over my words here, guys. There is this um, 
turkey day item there there's the Christmas tree there this is so cool even this cute little snow um, custom design on the floor it's all amazing oh yeah these lovely shell things oh and these are mermaid items Gosh, it feels like items. so long since that update, but it's so great. <laughs> oh gosh, look at the palm trees, how they've worked into the arch. That's stunning. See, when we get them on our island, I'm going to be so tempted to just shake them until the snow falls off, if that's even possible. <laughs> oh, I love these kind of coral starfish designs on the stone. Ooh. Look at these here, the little toy day items too. Oh my gosh, toys. Wait, is that a completely brand new bamboo item that you've not got before, JB? You know what I think it is? It almost looks like it's got some holly integrated to the side of it, so maybe it's... Wow. Toys. JB's discovered new bamboo. The oh bamboo. my oh. gosh. I'd forgotten about this part. This is insane. Look at all the gold. This is so cool. I love this King Tut entrance. The little masks. <laughs> wow. Oh, I've forgotten just how incredible this island is. I'm so excited to be back here right now. <laughs> Even with the gold spade. Totally amazing. Hey, play on words there, JB. Oh, the little teacup ride. Oh, I love this archway. I feel like it's one of the DIYs we missed out on, JB. Yeah, and it's a prominent one. Oh, abandoned. Aww. Still, they make it look amazing. Oh, and the ball and the mush DIYs. But they're kind of... Um, autumn things work so well with that abandoned vibe because it very much seems like it's natural things that have had, like been left to be natural so long that like there's stuff growing on them like those mushrooms. Indeed, and look at this. I almost feel that Red should like be here. Oh yeah. Pirate Cove. Wow. Look at that. I'm sorry, I just love spinning the umbrella. Oh, some bamboo. Oh, bonsai. <coughs> Whoa. Look at how stunning this is. I love the symmetry. Oh, the garden area. This is stunning. So, so, so stunning. I'm just gonna stand here so we're out of their way. Wow. But no, this creator is so amazing, like... They always try and tag us in these really helpful things, like custom designs, it's just... Oh, they're amazing. You've been serenaded, JV. Taylor Swift. 22. Aww. Oh. Piano waterfall. Stunning. Look, he's stunned, I'm he's sorry, starstruck. I'm sorry, I'm I'm moving. Sorry. Ooh. Ooh, a secret path around the back here. Ooh, that looks like an infinity pool. <gasps> Look at Red's beach. It's spooky. Ooh, a lovely cosy little reading area. Oh gosh, I love these designs. <laughs> the 
custom designs are so prominent on this island. Secret library and office. It's gorgeous. Books cranny, eh? JV's got a sense of humor today. Oh, do we need a vaulting pole? Yes! Oh my gosh, that was almost synchronized! Da -da 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 -da. <laughs> Come on, JB, don't be scared, buddy. He's just lazy, that's his problem. JB is the laziest person. Wow. <gasps> oh, wow. That's incredible. Infinity Pool! I wonder if we can Thanos snap. Oh, upper deck patio. Oh, the holiday candle and a Yule log. So much nice stuff here. Oh my gosh, yes. Oh, I was so engrossed in um, the island. I almost forgot about the house, but look how that, it's so, it's like the definition of white Christmas. I love how the whole entire house being white is contrasted with the red kind of reef on the door. It's stunning. It's and you just centering. set me up for singing. No, I didn't. You just said white Christmas, and in my head I'm like, uh. Ooh. Wow. Whoa. Okay, this is amazing. So we have stockings on the walls, on like every wall. Oh, and near the fireplaces, which is just so cute. Oh, the Merry trees. Christmas. Merry Christmas to all and to all a good night. Oh, sorry. These cute little mini trees. Oh, it's all just so perfect and festive. See, that's one kind of typical Christmas image that I've never seen done in real life, but it's like the stockings over the fireplace. I guess that's because you have a real fireplace that have set on fire. Whereas because we have an electric fire, we used to like pin the stockings above it every year. I just love it. More stockings. I've never seen it in my entire life. Oh, and look at the windows with the snow accumulating at the sides. This is magical. Like, I don't know, it's just like there's no other words for it. This is magic. Oh. KK Bosa. <laughs> so yeah, question for you guys who's like the like old Animal Crossing fans, played some other games and stuff. Um, JB was wondering about what song is most associated of yes. KK Sliders with Christmas. So for those of you in the premiere that know a little bit more than we do about Animal Crossing, has KK Slider ever done like Christmas performances, anything like that? Like what songs does he do for Christmas? Now obviously we are to expect a kind of overlay song like um, Halloween had that kind of do 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 do. So we're going to expect an equivalent of that playing all throughout I guess Toy Day. But it's like whilst you didn't get access to that on your stereo there's the obvious choices you know kk lullaby kk dirge kk hypno if you want to get a bit spooky with halloween but apart from stale cupcakes which vaguely um reminds me of kind of bells there is literally nothing that you can have as a stand-in for a christmas or even wintry kk slider song so if anyone does know if there's any like music that might be added in later, I would absolutely love to know because right now I'm not getting any Christmas vibes from any KK Slider music. As much as I hate to say it. <gasps> Ooh. Oh, this is my vibe. <laughs> this reminds me of the Christmas Eve party at my family's home. So we'd bring all the dining chairs into the sitting room and have them kind of set up around the edge like this. And then there'd just be like two big tables full of food. But like there'd literally only be this many chairs so like some people would be sat on the floor around here. I can even see the Christmas vibes in this room. I mean, the fact that you've said that is so great because I am pretty sure, now you guys don't hold me to this, but I'm pretty sure you said that last time we toured this island. So the fact that you can repeat those emotions just shows like the kind of essence of how this is such... I mean, it's homely. That's the kind of USP of this tour. And so the fact that it encapsulates what a family home could look like is just yeah. amazing. See, it just makes me laugh and smile seeing it because there's just those four little chairs. And then it reminds me that we'd try and fit 20 people in that one room. And it, like only four of them would have chairs and you'd all be sat on the floor and with these little paper plates. And so yeah, brings back some amazing Christmas memories that room. 
It's making me it's making me hungry. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh they got the mirror, some bike oh like, I feel like this is such a blue vibe, it's great. Oh, wouldn't you just I need to do the reaction, I'm sorry JB. Not that one. <laughs> wouldn't you just love to be sat there typing away and looking out of the window at that snow? Like, I imagine just a stunning snow scene outside of this window. It's all set up lovely at that bench and stuff. It's like the shining. <laughs> a lovely bookcase. And I like how they've kind of divided the room in two, similar as they did with the bathroom to make a utility too. I mean, it is stunning. This is like, if I could create a bedroom in Animal Crossing how I would want to, if I had like the kind of creative prowess, it would pretty much be that because that is great. That's like a luxury, like, thing. I don't know. I just, it's just brilliant. I love it. I love it. It's incredible. <gasps> I forgot just how fun this basement is. Look at that wallpaper. I feel like this is the only place we've seen this wallpaper. <gasps> now we're in New York. Um, you set me off. You type these things, JB. Whoa. There is just so much. It's jam-packed with goodness in her. But not in a way where you can't interact with everything. Like, you can sit on the sofa, you can get to the crafting bench. I didn't know the magician's um, hat did that. Learn something new from every tour, JB. Oh, I just finished typing abracadabra. <laughs> Watch me just scream it as we go into this new room out of context. Oh no. Abracadabra! <laughs> so I saved myself that um, miscommunication. Whoa. Ooh, the North Pole there, courtesy of Gulliver. And again, that stunning fountain area. I love that. To the North Pole, of course. Book club! <gasps> book. I, oh my gosh. I really want to join a book club. I nearly did. Like, I don't even know. Like, over a year ago now. Oh! Ooh. This is cool. Need a vanilla latte. Mm, matcha latte. Caramel latte for me, please. I'm kind of a sugar addict. I need I need a caramel latte. Oh my gosh, look at that! The ball placed on the mushroom. Mushroom. <laughs> so cool. Whoa. I'm scared we're gonna. G oh my gosh. I'm scared we were lost. Oh no, they're here. This is stunning. Look at the snowmen on both sides and the. This is the f oh, the snow on the trees and. Stunning. Oh, Ooh, is cool that Islander. Kyle. Chief. Chief, you got it right. I got it wrong. No. Sorry, JB. I tell him you stop. You go nose around, talk to folk, and enjoy yourself. Excellent. We are enjoying ourselves. The residents of Melatopia have started calling me Chief for some reason. I don't know why. This is cool. New toys! Sorry. New toys! Look at the toys, JV. I love the pop-up board and the doll's house. And oh, all of them, really. I don't think there's, like, one stinker in the toy lineup. If anything, I'm kind of getting greedy. I wish there were more. 
even more variants and more yeah. toys. But there's not one that's like weaker. Obviously, with Halloween and stuff, it's kind of like everything is great, but the pumpkin carriage is just that much better than the rest. It's like Definitely. in terms of scope and grandeur. But with the toys, it's kind of like I wouldn't trade the puppy for the RC car. But I also really love the the helicopter. Oh, it's just all great. It's amazing. See, my issue is, is I don't think I can do them justice. Like, I don't know what I'm going to do with them. I mean, I'm getting the most depressing variants on, I guess, my island quote, the original island. I'm, I've got the kind of black puppy dog, and I had the black or dark blue kid's tent. So it's kind of like, I don't know... See, we did a tour, um, so I think for you guys this would have been yesterday, and they had the circus variant of the tent, and I was, like, in love with that. Yeah, I did a little speed, well, not a speed build, I did a little design that I posted on Twitter, where it's, like, Pietro's circus. Whoa. <gasps> Look at oh this. Oh, my God. Look at the tree with the presents. Look at this one. Ah, this is so cool. I'm sorry. I got excited. Sorry. Oh my gosh. Look at this. Look at this, Jamie. And this is just so confident, so great how they've used an entire bridge as a build up to the museum. How great. It is. You don't often see this. Most people are like, oh, let's, you know, put two staircases in. This is really unique and beautiful. Red's Beach. So we saw a little teaser at this earlier, but we are actually here. Hey, JB. <laughs> it's a spooky, scary skeleton. Spooky, scary skeletons. Scary Red Beach. <laughs> Whoa. Look at these paths. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. is that like Genji's? Oh, my gosh. This is so impressive. Whoa. They did it. Like, they are perfectly aligned as well. Like, some people can get them where they're just in the same area, but this is perfect lining as well. That's brilliant. It's amazing. Oh. Oh, this is cute. I do love how there's kind of a whole different like biome, Aesthetic. I guess, to this part of the island. There's a spa back there. Check it out. Moon's End Garden. Oh, there look. Oh, we're heading in the spa. Oops. Aww, I can't daydream lying down. Sparring tea house. Ooh, there's another little area up here too. Our reactions keep getting blocked. Why are we still taking this vaulting power on with us? Sorry, JB. No. Ooh, the moon. It's cute. Oh, I love these mushroom lights. Oh, and it's Ooh. a like a greenhouse yeah a garden i was gonna center. say it's kind of like a garden center and for me they're really important at christmas because it's where you go to buy your decorations all that sort of thing it's just incredible and the snow one. <laughs> oh my gosh i love the kind of like garden aesthetic oh, oh there's a wedding oh my gosh the winter wedding 
I'm in love with this place. Would you get married in the winter, JB? Yeah, I'll get married in the winter. This sounds amazing. It's pretty cool. Oh, we've got some bamboo beets. Oh, look at this area. Oh my gosh, they've got a little space outfit for this place. A little space buggy in the back there. And oh wow, I love this item. I love how the little alien drops down. Ooh. Spooky aliens. I can't believe that. Fish market? Yes! Yay! This is so cool, there's so many. I need some fresh fish. Oh my gosh, this isn't even the end of it. I thought this would be the top of the beach. Whoa. Look at this. Wow, it's like a kind of stargazing area. Oh, oh you're about to be serenaded. And look, there's all the present pile there as well. Yeah, this is brilliant. It's like we're watching the virtuoso at work. Uh-huh. Wow. This is so cool. <gasps> Celestial items. Oh my gosh. Trying to spot Pascal off the coast there. It is great though, although I feel like this stuff would be great as like museum items. Because it reminds you of stuff that you get in like the Smithsonian. Mm. Oh, this is amazing. Look at this. <gasps> yes, this is it. This is, oh my gosh, the iconic. Oh, wow. <gasps> and that just looks stunning in the, in the winter. I don't know why, I'm in such a punny mood. Oh. I just Ooh, can't get enough book. of these mush DIYs. Well, this looks so kind of Sherlockian, almost Dickensian. Like, look at that, it's just so regal and, oh, I love it. Oh, and there's the earth there. Whoa, whoa, wow. whoa. This is magic. This looks like sacred ground where there's some stuff going on. Meteor garden. Meteor veggie. I'm so sorry, I'm... Uh, Are you okay? No, don't be mean to me. It's a special tour. <gasps> oh my gosh. Whoa. Oh my gosh. Ooh, a little clay workshop going on here. Balls. 
Oh, this is the part last time where you said that it was like they were the kind of um, the kind of king of this island and we were just like some little kid playing. Ooh, the campsite. And check out these lights on the trees. Whoa. See, I love how, like, the kind of brown, um, kind of dirt effect, it pops so well with the snow that I actually prefer the look of, like, the campsite vibe in the snow in general now. Me too. That's all, folks. Oh, that's all, folks. Well, this has been absolutely incredible. We have loved this island so much again the second time around. And so many new things to see. You wouldn't be able to recognise it from the first tour. It's honestly amazing. So, guys, we have lots of questions for this creator. Such as how many hours has it taken them to transform the island to be this stunning winter wonderland? So guys, we are going to revisit this island through the dream address where, as always, JB will have the questions and I will have the answers the creator gave. Okay guys, so here we are back on the stunning island of Cooperside for, as always, the Q&A with the creator. So JB has the questions that we've asked and I'm going to read the answers that the creator provided. Thank you so much. So we are so excited to be back on Cooperside. Oh, this is going to be amazing. So the first question we asked is how many hours did it take to transform your island? It took me 500 hours to finish the base aesthetic of my island, but I constantly tweak it every season. Ooh, that's so cool. And in terms of you know the, the, the new things that you've added, do you have a particular favourite edition? My favourite edition is the latest one, the fish market. I love the crazy cluttered vibe of it. It reminds me of my home country, the Philippines. I grew up here in California Bay Area though. Mm, see, and this is amazing. We spoke about this briefly last time with Eddie Sean when they um, said that the lighthouse is kind of replicating somewhere that they know. And so it's really cool that they've then furthered that concept and made this place seem literally like somewhere that they could consider home. So that is just amazing and we love that fish market so much. But, in terms of that kind of other end of the spectrum, what part was the hardest to create? The rock garden. It took forever. Wow. And we always have so much respect for those rock gardens because I, like, I definitely couldn't, wouldn't have the patience for that. They're just so difficult. And what was your favourite new item? Um, my favourite new items are definitely the toys and the Christmas decorations because they're so festive. They really are, and we're even showcasing quite a few of the kind of new items now with the snowman, the Christmas tree, and of course the sleigh and all the presents. It's just, it is festive goodness. It's the pinnacle of like Christmas, and I'm just loving it so, so, so much. Now, do you have any creator codes that we could share at all? Because you have some amazing custom designs on your island. Um, my creator code is. Okay, I'm just going to write this down for you guys. It's 4947-1174-7917. Hmm, that, that is really cool. So we are going to be sure to put that in the description down below. So if you do want to go into that little description section, you will find the creator code. In order to kind of utilize that, you'll just go into the Able Sisters, go into the kind of little ATM surface in the background, and you can just type it in and just scroll through all of Cooper Sight's amazing designs. Because, they, oh, they're just amazing. I'm certainly going to be doing that the second we finish this island tour. Wow. So, moving on. 
We, um, one of the ones that we love to ask around this festive season is, what is your favourite Christmas movie? Definitely The Nightmare Before Christmas. Oh, yes, 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 that's brilliant. Oh my God, I'm getting way too excited, but I always love finding someone else that loves The Nightmare Before Christmas. Oh, and there's so many people that have said that. I literally just want to get us all in like a Discord call one day and just do a watch along. I think that would be absolutely incredible. And what is your favourite Christmas song? Ooh, I think it is All I Want For Christmas Is You. And I said it without singing, guys. I did it. Are you proud of me, JB? I am really proud of you. That is that is just phenomenal. It's a great song. Now, what is the future of Cooperside? My island is always evolving every season. I decorate my island to suit the new seasons. So, I do a few tweaks here and there, depending on the new decorations and the new items. But I do want to keep the core design intact. Mm, very interesting. And kind of more on the future. What would you like to see in the next update? Mm, I want my visitors to visit my house more and to get more new items and decorating and more surprises. Mm, that would be... That'd be really cool, just some interactivity within the base game itself. That's that's a really great answer. So obviously we are in the dream address now, so there is a dream address available and it is of course updated for the winter season. So do you have a dream address that we can share with the amazing audience we have watching this video? Indeed. So guys, you might want to write this down because this island is something special. The dream address for Cooper Side is 7941. 2017-2217. So that's DA7941-2017-2217. Yeah, so you guys can visit this festive seaside town very, very soon. If you just want to go into the description, that will all be typed out for you. So you don't need to worry about memorizing it. You can quite literally just go on your Switch, get a video up and just go into the description and copy it from there. It's going to be amazing. We've also got Eddie's um, information on the screen right now. So if you do want to follow their Twitter accounts, one of them is specific to Cooperside, which is just amazing. So you're going to be sure to see some incredible updates as the island evolves. So guys, if you did love this island tour, please make sure to subscribe to the channel and hit that notification button as we are going to be doing these amazing tours every Every day leading up to the 25th. Indeed we are guys. So if you love all things Nintendo including Animal Crossing, Mario, even Jurassic World Evolution which is one of my new favourite games at the minute, then please like, comment and subscribe. JB and Miller.